want to start to release the birds hopefully at the beginning of next week. But of course it isn't just a case of opening the window and letting them into the next room. What we want to be able to do is to check each and every bird, give them vitamin shots and check their heart rate, check everything that we can before we let each individual go. Do nails, do everything to them so that they get a great new start again and it's less chasing around. And um, like I know that they'll chew all these leaves off in a heartbeat and that'll give them something to do to occupy them when we mix two, two huge flocks together. So that they'll be more interested in doing this than they will in attacking the space. So then all of a sudden everybody's set up. And then we find that um, the, like the, the still perching that can be done in here, which is great because it's an ongoing procedure anyway, it never stops. Probably 70 will go in here. 70? Yeah. And then there'll be another 70 when we do that side. That side won't take very long now because this was, this was his first time and you know we'd never made perching like this before so right. Who so to this? Victor. Victor Victor and Sasha oh, okay. yeah Sasha helped a lot with it so but it's it's Vic, Victor's plans and you know they've they've really done a great job are there any of the features that you'd like to point out that are kind of things you developed for yeah the fact that it's um, you know what we have is the canopy that's the most important thing it's a hundred feet long so the birds can fly for the hundred feet so macaws can fly flat then they can get the straight line instead of just sort of going like this from tree to tree they can actually really fly and um, there's nothing basically in their way they don't care they fly low and but they, they've got the canopy so that if anything disturbs them outside they're up the big thing that we have to organize is higher feeding stations it will come <laughs> everything comes it just takes time and there's this much to do